Your Highness, Chief Justice, Your Excellencies, Friends of the Global Center for Pluralism. My name is John McNee, and I'm the Secretary General of the Global Center for Pluralism. I am delighted to welcome you all this evening for our fourth annual Pluralism Lecture with the Right Honorable Beverly McLaughlin. We are delighted to be in Toronto tonight. This is the first time we have hosted the annual Pluralism Lecture outside of Ottawa. It is part of the Global Center's ongoing dialogue with Canadians about the, about, across the country about the building blocks of pluralist societies. <clears throat> Chers amis, nous sommes très heureux que vous soyez avec nous en si grand nombre ce soir à Toronto à l'occasion de notre quatrième conférence annuelle sur le pluralisme. Nous attendons avec impatience la conférence et la discussion en compagnie d'une ardente défenseuse du pluralisme, la juge en chef de la Cour suprême du Canada, la très honorable Beverly McLaughlin. Nous vous invitons à participer à la conversation en posant vos questions après la conférence lors de la discussion ouverte. Ladies and gentlemen, the Chief Justice is well known to all of us. Throughout her very distinguished career, she has demonstrated an enduring commitment to valuing difference and ensuring respect for others. This great gathering testifies to the esteem and, effect, and admiration that she enjoys in Canada and indeed around the world. We are greatly honored to have her speak this evening. Drawing inspiration from Canada's experience as a multi-ethnic, multicultural society, the Global Centre for Pluralism was established by His Highness the Aga Khan in full partnership with the Government of Canada. Its aim is to promote pluralism, which we define in shorthand as respect for diversity. The Centre is founded on the premise that when diversity is accommodated and valued, more peaceful and prosperous societies are the result. Headquartered in Ottawa, the Centre is a destination for dialogue. It exchanges research and learning from around the world about the challenges and opportunities of living together with diversity. This evening, we have the honour of hearing the Chief Justice. Following her remarks, David Walmsley, the Editor-in-Chief of the Globe and Mail, will engage her in dialogue, followed by an opportunity for the audience to ask questions. And we will be taking questions from our online audience who are watching this lecture via the Globe's live stream and whom we encourage to join the conversation as well. Finally, the Right Honourable Adrian Clarkson, Chair of the Centre's Executive Committee, will make closing remarks. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure I now invite His Highness the Aga Khan, Chairman of the Board of the Global Centre for Pluralism, to introduce our speaker.